may try to rename it, but it is still the hardcore title and it is about to be on the line. Done the rest of the anti fun police here, apparently back on the same page. Well, I for one am very, very happy about that because what a team this trio makes. to do it with a victory for the hardcore title, the No Funna title. That's exactly what it is. And until you get that into your thick head, we're going to keep calling that around here. You need to know, Dave Bradshaw. You need to know. Get with the program. Lucky kid. Never unusual. The one thing Lucky Kid is, for the one thing he is not, rather, for all the things that he is, he is not a thief. And Lucky Kid was framed by the anti-fun police in this case of El Fantasmo's missing sunglasses. Well, the lights are on, but there's no one home, if you ask me, when it comes to Lucky Kid. But what I saw with my own two eyes are unstoppable. I, for one, was so, so shocked. The success, the chemistry that Lucky Kid had with Chris Brooks, almost taking the Defiant Tag Team titles away from Aussie Open didn't quite happen. A chance to get back on the winning trail. I'm not sure No Fun Done really has any idea here what to make of the challenger for this title. I'm not exactly sure why Santos is out here either. He should be backstage preparing, stretching up those hamstrings. He is a big match against Visage. Yeah, he's had an interesting few minutes. He now knows that he is going to be part of that magnificent seven match, as is Visage. They go one on one, but first, first and foremost, for the No Fun title, here we have No Fun Done against Lucky Kid. You can call it what you like, but it is the hardcore title. He can rebrand it as much as he wants, but the rules of this title are that there are no disqualifications and weapons are allowed. Who However, put you in charge? Not, not my rules. How many authority figures do we want around here? Yeah, there's another interesting development. We now have a deputy to the deputy general manager. We are an ever-increasing bureaucracy here at Defiant Wrestling. Politics ruin everything. That's lucky kid doing. Lovely damn well pleases. I don't think anyone has been able to figure out the psyche of lucky kid to date here in Defiant Wrestling. Good luck to no fun done being the first to do so. Kid, of course, was part of that absolutely remarkable tag team title match at Unstoppable, teaming with Chris Brooks against the still champions, Aussie Open. Now, just about reached 300 days as champion. And of course, Aussie Open will be in action later on in non title action against all might, against Team White Wolf. What a challenge that would be. I was about to say something else, but for, you know what, forget it. Lucky Kid it takes me off my game every time. Lucky over the top. Lands on the outside. Well, hang on now. Here we go. Teamwork. Oh. Well, there we are. Is he done striking Santos? And now Whoa. Drake takes one from Lucky Kid. So much for being back on the same page. The numbers game not paying off for the anti fun police. Well, that's unique. Yeah, a kick from Lucky Kid and Kid has single-handedly taken all three members of the anti-fun police down. 
But that makes him a wanted fugitive. And what is he doing now? What is this all about? Getting a rest. Thumbs up for the referee. I'm telling you, Dave, that there is something about Lucky Kid. As talented as he is mentally, I'm not sure what to make of the guy. So Lucky Kid is searching under the ring for, presumably, for some weapons. And again, Dunn might not like it, but weapons are legal. There's a steel chair. No, no, weapons are fun. This is for the no fun title. It's not a no fun title. Shouldn't be allowed to use that steel chair, referee. Insecurity. That's Dunn. legal. So is the chair. Here we go. Dunn's unloading here on Rocky Kid. Kid having to deal with the distractions and the uh, slightly puritanical yeah. approach to weapons on the outside from the rest of the anti-fun police. You can't have it both ways. Dude. You can't say, yes, Lucky Kid's allowed to use chairs because there's no rules and this is a hardcore match and then bleat about the fact that the anti-fun police are sticking together and showing superior teamwork. Neither two. Dunn gets a, a two six. count. Well, deciding which rules to respect as you go along tonight, I see. Well, that seems to be the way of it these days in Defiant Wrestling. Zero consistency. But that's another topic for another day. Dunn charges in, Lucky Kid. Leap right out of the way! Put the elbow into the front of Dunn there, now exchanging waist lock. Whoa! Oh wow, lands on his knees, does Lucky Kid. And bring the back elbow! From this young man from Berlin. We'll see one thing for our esteemed general manager. He knows talent when he sees it. Lucky kid with a golden opportunity here. Sent to the outside there by Dunn, but straight back in. There's a slight transfer. Lucky kid, kid will go for the cover. Got the shoulders of the champion down. He was a second away from becoming the hardcore champion. Well, I think it would be a disgrace if Lucky kid became the no fun champion here in Defiance. Hilton well from Lucky Kid. Not going to work Ooh. twice. Oh! oh. Yeah, that backfired pretty spectacularly. Oh, no fun done. Another handspring. And this time, though, done with the headbutt. Some Rey Mysterio style action there from Dunn. The backbreaker. Dunn to retain the title. Kick out from Lucky Kid. No fun done. Can't believe it. Thought for sure that that was enough for the three count. A successful title defense of this no fun championship. I'm going to keep calling it that, Dave, until you well, get with it. Of course, you are. You need to know. Absolute sycophant. You need to know. Police. Here we go with Dunn. Run for the Springboard Lung Blower, I think. And then instead, sit out power bomb of sorts from Lucky Kid, who shoulders have done down for another two count. Lucky Kid not wasting any time. Okay, lucky on the Top turnbuckle here, Dunn hasn't seen him. And a drop kick right between the shoulder blades from Lucky Kid. Kid could be moments away from championship gold here. This is trouble for the anti-fun oh. police. Oh, there we go. That's more trouble for Lucky Kid because look at this. God bless HT Drake. Drake has the leg. Oh my, he's the belt. Oh, so much for no weapons. So much for no weapons, for goodness sake. Defend that. <laughs> Here is your winner, and still no fun champion, no fun done. You want me to defend it? You want me to go ahead and defend what we've just seen? You know what we've just witnessed? We've just witnessed unity from the anti-fun police, and I think that's pretty special. They are united, and no fun done is still. Wait a minute. Well, hang on, there's El Fantasmo. Now Fantasmo is he doing here? unfinished business. With the anti-fun police, because you see Phantasmo still hasn't got his glasses back. Where did that microphone come from? What's going on here? Where's my glasses? Where's my glasses? No, Santos, no, those aren't here. Well, standoff here is oh, Fantasma demanding his glasses. The no fun or hardcore champion, no fun done, insisting that he does not know their whereabouts. But he's not the most trustworthy of men, is he? Done. It doesn't matter what you say. 
He's the no fun champion. Well, Fantasmo still without glasses as he looks after the defeated lucky kid as loaded rolls on.